for most athletes, losing a leg is a career ending obstacle. But for one sprinter, it opened the door to record breaking performances and Olympic appearance appearances. Cronkite News reporter Andy Krause found out what propelled one athlete beyond the barrier that holds back so many others. Many para-athletes come from an athletic background before their disability alters the way they can compete forever. But few of them have bounced back and achieved success in Paralympic competition as quickly as sprinter Jared Wallace has. Wallace received an athletic scholarship to run at the University of Georgia before a severe case of compartment syndrome below his right knee led him to opt for amputation when he was 20 years old. I uh, made a decision that was a, a tough one, but ultimately was the best decision to have my leg amputated. And, um, you know, no pun intended, hit the ground running and, and uh, you know, recovered really quickly. Uh, probably about six weeks from amputation, I was walking, and three months after amputation, I was running again. Jared's desire to be faster than anyone else is a big part of why he's already won two world championship gold medals and broken four world records in the sprints. He is also a two-time U.S. Olympian. The day I made the decision to have my leg amputated, I re researched and Googled the world record list for Paralympic sport, and I pointed the screen, my, called my parents in and said, I'm going to be on this list. And, you know, it was just always, uh, you know, my, my nature to, to dream big and to set big goals for myself. That's a quality that has really helped Jared in furthering his cause off the track. Before his competitive days are over, he wants to prove that disabled athletes have the same capabilities as their able-bodied counterparts. If you put Jared on a football field, he'd run faster than a lot of the guys who play professional football in the NFL. And that's just, you look at his times, I mean, that's a fact. And um, he's just an exceptional athlete. You know, my identity is not defined by the fact that I have a prosthetic. And, you know, other people's identities are not defined by, you know, losing an arm or because they're in a wheelchair. You know, it's, it doesn't change who you are. After taking gold at the U.S. Paralympics Track and Field National Championships in the 100 meters at the beginning of June, Wallace will go for his third gold medal at the World Championships in mid-July. In Los Angeles, Andy Kraus, Cronkite News. Wallace is an ambassador for Shamrock Prosthetics, a company which helps amputees rebound after their surgery.